Officer Donovan Hevener, a 27-year veteran of the Federal Way Police Force, an off-duty run-in with crime has now left him hospitalized tonight. And investigators say he almost didn't make it. So thanks for joining us tonight at 10. I'm David Rose. This all happened this morning in Puyallup. Officer Hevener was on a jog, his morning jog, and he witnessed a burglary in progress at a business. And that's when police say he was shot and the suspects drove off. Now, as the investigation gets underway tonight, take a look at this map. Puyallup police are asking everyone in these homes and businesses inside the area there in the square to check your cameras for video of the suspects or their vehicles. Fox 13 News reporter Jennifer Lee takes a closer look tonight at the evidence collected so far in this case. They're not given enough credit um, for the work that they do for us. A disheartening day in Puyallup. Our officers, whether they're in their uniform or not, they're always on duty uh, and they always do the right thing. Surveillance photos captured this silver or white Chevy pickup truck. Puyallup police believe it's a burglary suspect speeding away after firing shots and injuring a federal way police officer. His injuries are very serious, but he is expected to survive. Federal way police say the officer is Donovan Hevener, a 27 year veteran on the force. Investigators say he was on a morning jog in Puyallup when he witnessed two men trying to break into a business on River Road. He observed two subjects and two vehicles that were trying to break into the Jennings equipment business on the corner of that intersection. As one of the vehicles was fleeing the scene, it appears someone in the vehicle fired, striking the officer. The officer went down at that time. Detectives were processing three crime scenes, one by Jennings equipment, the second where the officer collapsed on River Road, and here half a mile away in this otherwise quiet neighborhood. I heard this big thump. Puyallup police believe the burglary suspects were here shortly before the shooting. I could see that there was a big black trunk like would come out of the back of a truck in the middle of the road. Officers say the second suspect was in a black pickup truck that also fled the scene. It's hard for me to talk about when you think, you know, when I've lived here my whole life and just to see how the changes and so much of this happening everywhere. Officer Hevener was rushed to Tacoma General Hospital and now neighbors are sending their well wishes for his recovery. We have such little regard for the feelings of other people and their lives, but I have hope that it'll get better. In Puyallup, Jennifer Lee, Fox 13 News. The neighbors told police they heard the suspect speaking Spanish, though they believe they are Hispanic. Federal Way Police say Officer Hevener works in their administration's division doing background checks for all new hours, new uh, hires, pardon me. But it's his work with Special Olympics Washington that really stands out. Even dressing up in a penguin costume in 2018 for the Tacoma Polar Plunge to help Federal Way PD's team raise money for the athletes. He's currently the state director for the Washington Law Enforcement Torch Run overseeing more than 2,000 officers who participate in the event. And while he's out of surgery now, his injury is still said to be serious, so he has a lot of people pulling for him tonight with Special Olympics and all around the state. So here's a look one more time at that white or silver Chevy four-door pickup truck Puyallup police are trying to find as they work to identify the suspects involved. We've put detailed information on how you can submit a tip directly to police or through Crime Stoppers. It's on our website. Just look for this story at Fox 13 Seattle dot com.